What's up, horror fam? Steven, a.k.a. Bojangles here. And come closer, my friends. I have something scary to show you. Never get out of bed again! We're friends to the end. Remember? Today, we're going to talk about what inspired the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Now, it is true that the Texas Chainsaw Massacre was partially inspired by real-life killer Ed Gein, but that's not what this video is about. Still, if you want to know more about Ed Gein, you can check out some of my previous videos I did on him, which I'll link to in the description below. <laughs> Now, to put it plainly, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre wouldn't be the same without, well, a chainsaw. I mean, it's right there in the title. Ed Gein, however, isn't exactly known for wielding a chainsaw. So, what inspired Toby Hooper to unleash a chainsaw massacre on the public? Well, that's where things get a little creepy. <laughs> You see, it was around Christmas and Toby Hooper was doing a little bit of shopping for the season. And he was in a crowded department store. Picture something like a Sears. There were thousands of other shoppers around him and it was really starting to get on his nerves. He was making his way through the crowd and couldn't wait to get out. That's when he found himself in front of a chainsaw display. That's when something sinister popped into his mind. If he picked up a chainsaw and started that bad boy up, people would get out of his way pretty quickly, and then he'd be able to navigate his way out of the department store much more easily. While driving home, Hooper's mind went to work on what he had thought about in the department store, and he decided that he was going to incorporate the chainsaw into an idea he had already been working on about young people in isolation. Is anybody here? And that, my friends, is how the Texas Chainsaw Massacre came to be. So, the massacre may be over, but the horror is just beginning. <laughs> If you want to be a part of it, make sure you subscribe to the channel and follow the Big TH on social media for future updates. Until next time, my friends, look horror, listen horror, talk horror.